Welcome. So what I like to do is show you how to expand this logarithmic expression. And the first thing I notice is, you know, I have this exponent out in, um, I have the exponent out. So I want to be able to put that out in front. So I'm going to take the exponent on using my properties of logarithm, and I'm going to write that in front. So I have 3 log 2 square root of x divided by 5. Now, again, when looking at this, you know, now we have our properties of logarithms, right? But each one of these properties of logarithms, remember, is always going to be raised to that power of 3. So what I'm going to do now is introduce my brackets. So I'm going to keep that 3 outside of there. And now I'm just going to apply my properties of logarithms inside the bracket. So the first one I'm going to do is I can see I have the, pro um, I can see I have the product is being divided by 5. So therefore, I can simply just write log base 10 of 2 plus log of the square root of x minus, as working left or right, and all of that is divided by log um, base 10 of 5. Okay. Then I notice that this, this square root can be rewritten as 1 half, which I can bring in front. So I have 3 log base 2 plus, oops, bring the 1 half in front, 1 half log of x minus log of 5. Again, remember when we're working through our logarithms, we're going to um, we are going to be working from left to right. However, if you just want to make sure, you know, you can also produce, you know, some extra parentheses to make sure you do that product first. But just working from left to right, we'll always be doing those um, first, anyways. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you expand your logarithmic expression. Thanks.